How's it hanging? Hey, Brucey, what's up? Hey, Nico B. Come here, show me the love man whoa, hug enough, time. Whoa, enough, all right? Whoa, whoa, what are we about here, you and me? I don't know. What are we about, boy? Oh, I'm an immigrant and a hired gun, and you're a steroid junkie, but we get along. No, not that stuff. That's superficial. I'm talking about the real shit. What? We're winners, man. Fucking winners. That's how we roll, brother. Bling, check. Bodies, check. Paper, check. That's how we roll, bitches. The boss. Are you all right? Too much bullshark testosterone up the uh, ass? Fuck you. Fuck you, man. Hey, check this out. Lenny! Lenny! Is the bitch ready? Well, she's very shiny. Look at her and weep tears of pure gold. Motherfuckers. Come on now. Let's go show some people just how we roll. Yeah, all right, come on, get in. Come on, start you! Shit. Pure gold, eh, big man? <laughs> Lenny, you're a fucking asshole. What is this? What is this? You two to yourself! Well, what should I do? I mean, I need a flashy car. People are gonna think I'm a no-nut bullshitter if I fail to deliver here. How about Steve's car? Yes. I'll call him on the way. Nico, can you drive us to Freetown Avenue and Willis? Yeah. Come on. Let's roll, bitches! Woo! Come on, Nikki, we need some wheels. To Freetown Avenue, okay? Good as gold. Nico, man, excuse me, but I gotta make this call to tell this guy we're borrowing his car. Stevie boy, how's tricks? No, man, you, you can spot me. Haha, <laughs> yeah. For sure. All right, uh, listen, man. All right, listen, me. Me and my ice cold friend Nico gotta borrow your car. No, no, no. The other one. Oh, of course it'll be cool. What? Oh, it's outside? Great. Love you, man. He's fine with us taking it? We won't have an incident like the last time I got the car for you? No way, man. That, that was a one-time only, baby. Me and Stevie are tight. Okay, tighter than that. Tighter than... T shit, I was gonna say my abs, but I think you know that nothing's tighter than this shit. Yeah. Wanna feel? Mm. Thanks, but uh, I got my hands full. God, this is exactly the type of shit you and me should be doing. Cruising for bitches, destroying the town. You and me could be doing some serious damage, like like a nuclear bomb up in this shit. But, but, but a sexy bomb, you know? A bomb that only affects girls with D-cups, tight asses, blonde hair, no cellulite, and tan. Yeah! Right. Uh, I don't know if I get your meaning, but uh, we can hang out sometime. This is it. Thank you. Here we are. See what I mean? Sweet! We got a race to win! So, when we get there, will you be driving? No way, man. I'm just here to look good. Me and you are cruising together. That's how we roll. Passenger side, flexing the guns, scoping the chicks, flashing the bling, pumping the sounds, riding shotgun while my boy Nico pulls off some badass Red Army, pedal to the metal, skin of your teeth, burnt rubber moves. Am I right? Is that our style? Because I think that that is how we roll up in this shit. Man, I... Here we be. You ready to feel the cheese? Whoa! The skin looks really rough, man. You had some help? A little, a little botulism special there? I like that, homie. Do you want a shot when we get back? I'm fine.
You seem kind of legit. Why you need guys killed? Of course I'm legit. Have you seen my delts? That shit is as legitimate as it gets. What about these guys you need killed? Fuck Nicky. You know Brucey. He's number one. It's lonely at I the top. To Sometimes shit, the juice, it just old. takes control. Show okay, right. red mist descends and I need shit to happen to people. Are you talking about fucking roid rage? Is that why I killed those men? Oh, they were bad cats, Nicky. Maybe the juice meant I wasn't as uh, patient as I should have been. But you know, as a businessman, I can't let people get away with shit. I need to be firm. Look, Bruce, I like you, and I think we should hang out, but I don't want to work with you no more. I can't go around fucking people up because you've overdone it on the juice. Oh, all right, Nicky, man, I'm feeling you, okay? You don't want to let our business thing get in the way of our personal relationship. That's all good, man. Cool. Nikki, I feel like we really bonded back there. I'm close to you, man. You let me inside. You, you, you let your armor down, you know? We had a moment, man. Call me, and we'll hang. Sure we did.
go. I think Roman has been kidnapped. I heard he owes some Russians money. A friend of mine saw him at that car club on home point. He owed them money? He never told me anything. I heard they took him to a warehouse off Long Park and Bohan Industrial. I'll check it out. So we need to go. I got a meat grinder cheap off the internet last week. It cuts fine. If you say so. If you want to walk out of here, Slav, you're going to have to think about how you will pay your debt. A friend of mine, Dmitry Raskolov, he would pay a lot of money for your cousin. I'll get you the money, just not that way. I wish I had been loved more as a child. I fuck, I fuck with this mission heavy. I like this fucking shootout. Look at the destruction. Look at the, look at that. Look at the detail. Your cool. ah! no, but like, if this game was made into an action movie, bro, I'm telling you, this guy would probably make a, a couple hundred million, bro. This guy would break even. I'm not even break even. This would be a successful ass action movie. They made an action movie. Out of Nico Bellic's story, bro. This shit raw. Yeah, that's sad, bro. This nigga didn't appear in GTA 5. I mean, it would be hard to make him appear in GTA 5. He would have to be very, very, um... It had to be very, very big with his with his background, given the options I like. Because, you know, this story actually actually contains fucking choices and shit. So, like, say if... Because like, he has two very important people. I ain't, I ain't gonna say that, but they're... People close to him die in this game, depending on your choices. And if he would have appeared in GTA 5, that, that would have been, been kind of hard to dance around. But they would have to choose, um, choose a canning ending. A canon ending. And, uh, you know what I'm trying to say? They're like with Packy, because Packy appears in there. But he never describes like, who, who in his family did he lose in this game. Because I think he can lose. I think he can lose like three people in this game. Depending on your choices. Actually pretty cool. Whatever. You are not on my cousin! Yeah man, like I said, nigga, this is Get really, really groundbreaking game. Shit, bam, Die, you shit. Now this in this playthrough it glitch. They don't usually do that. Get stuck behind that gate. Afraid, friend. Just let him fall. No, even finish that nigga. Off. Just let him fall and uh. Then this even. I don't know if this. I don't know if this more painful to getting shot. I mean, he, he got shot before he fell, so he's suffering from that while falling. That's a horrible way to go out. Look at these niggas. Let, let that nigga fall. Let him fall at the last level. Hey, 
Es Aikeide, gol. Also, for all the people that's wondering why I sometimes do commentary and I don't do commentary, sometimes I, um, not sometimes, but most of the time I have my daughter with me. And, um, since my grandmother and my little sister had COVID this week, longer. the last week, they, I couldn't, you know, just give my daughter to them, or she couldn't go in their room, so they had, she had to be with me most of the time. So that's why I couldn't record like I really wanted to, or narrate like I really wanted to. Because you're here in the background playing with the toys. Thank you, cousin. You saved my life. We should get out of here. Yeah, what about that? Yeah, she she coming in and playing with toys and you know play on a on a tablet and just have like a whole bunch of copyright songs playing in the background. And, There's um, a car. Take trying me home, not to get the monetized sections. Well, I'm not even fucking monetized in the first place, but I don't even know how that affects your monetization. Look at look at this fucking dumbass, bro. Like this, <laughs> man, nigga. I was this nigga here, Roman. I was pushing this nigga downstairs. So look at this nigga, bro. What the fuck is going on? Probably drunk as shit. I said, I'm gonna see if he do it again. Take a nigga long ass time to get up. I think he appeared in the car with me. Oh, there you go. That's a good fat nigga. Oh, he was programmed to get in that truck. Oh, was they okay when, I, when that shit happened? When that shit happened. Man. We have reports of shots fired at the warehouse off Lompoc, Bowhead, and Dustfield. What happened, Roman? You have been gambling. I give you money. How are you in debt? There are cycles, cousin. You must lose a little to win a lot. Come on, my cards were not good. Roman! That man knew Dimitri. He was trying to make me give you up to him. I would never... Of course you would not. Dimitri has taken this too far. He wants you dead. Bohan is not safe. Are you okay? I'm used to taking these beatings, Nico. I almost expect it now. Wherever I go, there are people who want... I'll never marry Mallory. I won't be able to sleep with another college girl. There is a knife hanging over me. A clock is ticking. I'm in the rush. If you say so. Man, this is out of control. I know. What are we going to do? I don't know. We're going to die. I don't want to die, man. Not like this. How would you like to die? Having a threesome on my hundredth birthday? I don't fucking know. I'm scared, you cold bastard. What are we going to do? I'm not cold. You're cold. All you care about is your bank. Getting your own way. And all you care about is money. And gambling it away on the internet. Oh, isn't America great? I get to sit in front of a computer and play Mr. Rich Man and get into debt with crooks. Okay, I messed up. I know I did. I thought things would be different. I, I don't understand this place so good. Oh, man, what are we going to do? Stop sitting in front of the computer gambling our money. Stop uh, getting into illegal card games. Stop spending all our money. Yes. Thank you. And stop thinking about the Russians, men. We just need to disappear as far as they're concerned. Disappear! Okay, okay. But I want Florian and Darko. I need to know what happened. Give me that. Fine, but leave the Russians alone! I was not the one gambling in their private club. I didn't know! Give a guy a prey! Okay! Okay. Okay. I'm going to clean up. I have a nasty feeling I had a bit of an accident back there. And Nico. What? Thanks.
Hey, what's up, guys? Um, shit, this guy hit over the muscles. To me, this is the most one-sided decision in gaming history, or, in, or at least in this game's history. If I kill one of these niggas, all I get is like four hundred thousand dollars in the game when you can't buy shit. And um. I actually like that you can't buy anything in this game. I mean, it's not that much stuff to buy, cause I think it shows how um how immigrants view, you know what I'm saying? Like how they how they have their priorities straight, or some immigrants have their priorities more straight than anybody else. Cause say like in this game, like there's there's car there's car dealerships and everything like that. And Nico like, doesn't like, focus does not on those classic classic cars that just drives whatever the fuck. You you see what I'm saying? So like, um, or where are you going, that, man? Like, I want to go to uh, Zeno Time Street. Sorry about the smell. I just laid some gas in here. Months. You know what I'm saying? If you just think about it, it actually does kind of make sense why there is. We don't have like here we are. Southern Southern it's a wrap. Thank Idaho, you very much. Like in fucking um, like in um, GTA 5 and shit. You know what I'm saying? Because the thing about it, what the, what the fuck is an immigrant fresh out the boat gonna know about like stocks? Or fucking um Nikki, you animal stocks and the guys we raced you know, the other day want a rematch. They like your shit, like man. Fucking, cool. Like, I guess. Well Anytime fuck, you know what I'm saying? You know, finance and fucking and cars and shit location, like that. Pete, you understand what I'm trying to say? It made that makes a lot of sense now. That's a old like now that I'm a grown man looking back at this. So like he spends his money on the most necessities like travel, entertainment, fucking uh food. You know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, ammo, because, you know, he's, he's a fucking killer. I'm just saying, like, it, it the game, this game makes more sense as you age. You know what I'm saying? It always made sense, but now that you age, you get to see, like, the. What's up, money? You know, what hey. makes this game so immersive Man. and realistic? Business is tough. And I ain't a cold person. I, I mean, I am cold, but. Motherfucker. What are you talking about? You want a drink? Uh, man, have a seat, man. All right. Now, I got into this dope game because it was the only thing that was open to me, man. The only thing, man. Hey, I am not judging. No, listen. Now, I paid my dues. Now, I learned in a hard school, man. And I changed stuff. You know me. I do this stuff so I got a chance to do some good in this town. So you say. So I say. So I do. When I get the money, man, I will build parks. I will sponsor kids. I will save lives. But I gotta have the money, man. Is all this? All this, it means nothing if you ain't got the heart, Nico. Amen, brother. <laughs> I mean, fuck, man. Fuck! The thing is, you know, Jesus, he did some crazy shit, too. I mean, everyone does. He killed people. He killed that John the Baptist cat. He did what he had to. I don't think you're correct about that. Man, the point is, man, history is a long time. And you only got one chance. And Dwayne, man, Dwayne, it's like he thinks it's 1992, and the best that you can hope for is a gold chain and a pager. You know, he looks at me like he wants me dead. Now, I took care of business. I gave him money, but because I won't bow down to him and treat him like he the almighty, motherfucker wants to pop me. Dwayne is a little troubled. He was in prison a long time. Maybe you guys should talk. No, I tried talking. No, I, I, I tried giving him half of the business. I tried everything a man could reasonably try and still call himself a man. <laughs> so what you gonna do? Kill him? Hey, I didn't say that. Man, you cold. I was joking. But what else is there? I mean, Cash been talking. Now I hear things. Said you and me was too tight now. Said you disrespected him. Called him mad. <laughs> he's gone crazy. I mean, he's gone. Prison does that. Well, you can't kill him. Nope. But you can. But I don't want to. Well, neither do I, man. But if he goes insane, we all dead anyway. 
I mean, Dwayne is a killer. Ah, I don't like this conversation. Do you think that I do? But it's kill or be killed out there. You got a lunatic after you? Man, you dumb. <coughs> now, I will give you a lot of money. Because see me? Now, I ain't scared of no one. But a motherfucker says he's gonna kill me, the motherfucker's gonna die. Huh. Man, I'm not sure. I got to think about it. Well, I hope you see some sense. I will be in touch. Got out. Things just don't make no sense. If things ever made sense? They made sense inside. Three meals a day, time in the yard, lockdown at eight. Things out here is mad crazy. Tell me about it. On the down low, I think Playboy wants me dead. Might just let him do put a cap in my dome. End it all. That what you want? Seriously? Nah, fuck that shit. I ain't ready to go out yet. I need you to get him for me. I can't do it myself. He was my boy back in the day. That's something I won't be able to forget. You seem like you got my back, Nico. Help me out on this one, dog. I'll stick by you till the end. Take him out for me. That's a pretty heavy request, Dwayne. Playboy was your best friend. And he's always been straight with me, more or less. I'll have to think about it. Yo, if you're trying to find Playboy, you should ask your bitch. <laughs> this is Dwayne. Guess not. <laughs> <laughs> 